here. Nobody tells me anything. Wow, what the heck? <laughs> what is that? They finally add stuff in here. Do I need to be surprised? Of course not. This should be happened a long time ago. But Striker was too lazy to freaking rotate his own shop. His own shop. But anyway, oh my god, what the heck is that? Ooh, they catch butterfly with those. My kitty. What? Look at all those materials though. Jesus, man. Striker demands so much ingredients. This is why I hate him. But anyway, at least I know he finally rotate his own shop so that's great let's move on to the main topic of this video and that's the quest the quest is happening in liquid valley and uh you can't sit with us actually megan i can't sit anywhere i have heroes shut the up Sorry, I was watching TikTok. <laughs> oh, by the way, speaking of TikTok, you should go follow my TikTok account. I'll be mainly focused on uploading funny gameplay moments or um, animation if I really have the time to animate stuff. Uh, maybe in the future, I might do the cringy TikTok dance thing. My god. I swear, if I start doing the TikTok cringy thing, it's gonna be like 100 times more cringier than any other TikTokers out there, trust me. <laughs> Woo! Whoa, that scares me. Holy, that is the first time I've ever seen you. I mean, that kind of creature I've seen like many, many times, but... That color! Oh wow, this looks like Simba from The Lion King, but it goes so wrong. <laughs> you should call yourself Simba. I came to feed fair Poofy. As I do at every dawn, and to my ardent horror, I discovered he God! Oh, the poofy thing? Oh, I remember. It was right behind this tree. There's like a little inspiration thing. I didn't think that it was your pet. Poofy's disappeared? I fear our little friend was thieved. For on his own, he can't far travel. And a pretty price a poof would fetch. Oh, if he's so, I may unravel. Don't worry, I'll find him. A hero to the lumberjack you would truly be if you could bring old Poofy back to home and your safety. Alright, I'll help you find the Poofy thing. Find the poachers. Okay, I wonder where it is though. Whoa, all the way here? <laughs> what? What are you? Who are these people? You and me are about to be on easy street. My pal, you sure we should be doing this, Dodge? This seems pretty low, even for us. You kidding? The society we shout out for we are pets. Or like, their rituals? Nah, uh, nothing bad like that. They like to do that thing with their pet, the cradle in their lap, and monologue, or three to go like. You know how they get. Now come on, we gotta get moving. It's Poofy! <laughs> poofy, no! Distract the poachers. Find a way to distract them. Alright, let's distract them by climbing on a tree? What? How is that going to work? I mean... Oh, okay. Huh? What was that? Rescue Poofy. Release Poofy from that cage. Interesting. Oh, would you look at that? Look at these pets here. I mean, I don't know. Maybe they're not pets. Uh, uh, look at that. Patrick, it's not starfish. It's ballfish. It looks like a ball. We got a clam shell here. Whoa, we got the little void beetle here. What's this? Oh, Pickin! Pickin's got captured. <laughs> got a little... Oh, it's the little... The little flying thing. We got a butterfly here too. Now we gotta go free the Poofy. The Poofy doesn't even move. Is Poofy a living being or is it like a statue? I mean, look at it. It's not even moving. It's not even breathing. But anyway, let's let's help her for the sake of Simba. Oh yes, yeah, so of course I'm gonna smack it with my hammer. Twelve seconds later. A few moments later.
20 minutes later. Two hours later. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. <laughs> what should I do again? Confront Dodger and Banks. Give those two a piece of your mind. What? Do I need to like smack them with the hammer or something? Is that what you want me to do? I mean, I can do that. So, you freed the fluff. I was never going to let you get away with this. The spark's right, Doge. I don't think I could sleep at night if we saw out these critters. <laughs> Fine. Look. Here's the deal. You save me for myself, and I give you a nice reward to not turn us in. Not invisible, pal. I guess, but I'm watching you. Here, we ain't gonna speak of this again, Kippiche. Oh, giving me a necklace. Ah, Harold's necklace. A jingle to send a chill down your spine and swoop through your belly. What? The description is really confusing me. Anyway, thank you so much for the jingle balls necklace. Now I'm going to sing the Jingle Balls. Hopefully Santa Claus is coming to town. He sees you when you're sleeping. He knows when he will jingle your balls. I mean bells, bells, yes, jingle your bells. The, the doorbells, yes, that's right, that's right, doorbells. Santa doesn't go to a chimney these days because they're fat. They, 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 they get too lazy of coming to your house through the chimney, so they have to use the freaking jingle bells of your doorbells to get inside, you know?